Alrighty, what's going on guys, and welcome to another unboxing slash haul. Um, got a little bit of everything today. Um, this should be interesting. I think I know what it is. Uh, we'll do that last time. I'll go over, actually, you know what, no, we'll do it now because the box is in mind. Yeah, I hope you guys are all enjoying the unboxings. I'm enjoying doing them. Until I run out of stuff to buy. And it's going to be very, very, uh, obviously hard then to buy stuff you don't own anymore. Look at this, if what I believe it should be, it is. Now there's no cover for it, unfortunately. Um, how do I, aha, uh -huh. that was the other way. Okay, so, yeah, it's the Halo Reach, like, limited edition, collector's edition, special edition, whatever the fuck you call it. It's quite cool. Um, going through, like, a collector's edition kind of kick at the moment. Uh, that's a big book. How do you, uh, how do you open that? I don't know. Open it through that. Uh -huh. That's quite cool. So yeah, it's like a <clears throat> a big diary from Halsey with pictures and postcards and all of that flashy kind of stuff. So that's quite cool. And even the uh, even the pictures in there are quite cool. Even that, being like, top secret, eyes only, that kind of stuff, that's awesome. I like that. I like that a lot. So, yeah. Nice. So, Halo Reach. I wish I had the sleeve, but it was only like £14 on, on uh, eBay. So, happy with that. Right, now the game hauls. This should be... Relatively quick. So I've got one for the PS5 here, Guardians of the Galaxy. It was seven pound, um, and I'm really trying to fill up my uh, my PS5 shelf. So I'm just buying PS5 games. I don't know if it's any good. I don't particularly like Marvel or Guardians of the Galaxy or any kind of superhero game. So I can't talk about it because I know nothing about it. So we'll leave that there. I've got three PS4 games. So I've got Killing Floor Two. Um, I did already own this. Uh, if you've watched the channel, you know we've made videos on this and stuff. It's a cool game. Um, it gets very, very old very quick, though. So, especially when you're playing on your own. But six-player co-op. So, if you get a group of your mates together, you can have a lot of fun with this. It is cool. Like, there's weapon skins. There's new, like, there's not new. There's classes. Like, if you like healing, there's a medic class. If you like melee weapons, there's a brawler class or... I can't remember what it's called. It's a fun game. Um, I just... Yeah, well, once you play it on your own, it's kind of very, very kind of samey. But it's fun. Um, in fact, I might play it again soon. I'm not sure yet. I'll have to do an update. Right, next. Da -da. We've got two Wolfenstein games. So I do own all of the Wolfenstein games on Xbox. But I'm trying to get them all on PS4 because PlayStation for me is easier to record and edit on. But I do already own these, but this was like four or five pound, and this again was like four or five pound. So I thought, why not? You know, as of this recording, I've already played and beat the whole game. Um, that's going to go up after Christmas, which is probably when this goes up. But that was a lot of fun. I didn't realize just how much I was enjoying. Well, I, I don't remember how much I enjoyed this game until I played it. It's so over the top, it's so out there, but it's so fun, it's so cool, and it's like, so over the top that you don't take it seriously, and I think that's why I enjoyed it a bit more, and the old blood is what we're playing through now, um, it's like a, I don't really know, it's like a little DLC kind of thing, but it's a full game, um, I'm currently playing through that now, um, in fact I've just made part two, so, yeah, that's quite cool, I've got 
three Switch games. I can't remember if I've already shown this off, but I've got Minecraft on the Switch. I'm not going to say much about it. I've got Mario Kart 8 on the Switch. It's quite cool. I suppose I can chuck it in. Why not? Got my Christmas present early off my lovely girlfriend. I've got the OLED Switch in white. It's so cool. She won't be too much for it. It's ridiculous. Yeah, I love her a lot. And the complete edition of The Witcher 3. Now, this was like £4 on um, eBay because it doesn't actually come with the game. Um, so, I need to get the game. I will get the game. And I'm going to play through. Obviously, the new version's coming out soon and blah, blah, blah. But I can play The Witcher in bed. So, all these different slips and stickers and that's a map. And it comes with a soundtrack. So, that's quite cool. But yeah, it was, it was £4 for this. And I thought, you know, if I could just buy the game, then I've kind of already technically got a complete special collectory edition of a game on the Switch. And that right there is my Switch collection. We're not really, uh, not really living life up, are we? Uh, Age of Empires 3 on the PC. We've got a few PC games, <clears throat> and that's it. So... I love Age of Empires. Um, I need to install it and play it. This has probably got the thickest manual I've ever seen in my life. It's huge. It's a girthy boy. Let's make sure I blow that out. But yeah, I've never played three. I can't remember. I played a lot of one. I can't remember if it was Age of Empires one or not. But there's loads of them. So I'm very interested to play that. Um, I can't say much about this one because I've never played it. Uh, two Sims games, I don't really know much about the Sims, I don't play Sims, so, um, whether it's good or not, I have no idea, we shall see, I swear, why does this camera look like it? there's no room at all, I'm so confused, oh don't throw it, hello, right. Desert Rats versus Africa Corpse, it's like a, Almost like an Age of Empires style game, but set in, in Africa. Desert Rats were the British. And Africa Corpse, I don't know if that's a German thing or not. 70 units available, each with complementary characteristics. Should be interesting, it'll either be good or bad. Uh, and then I've got some throwaway games here that I'm not going to spend any time talking about because I don't care. Mini Golf... City Life 2008 edition and F1 Challenge 2019, uh, 1999 to 2002. I don't care. I don't care about Formula 1. So, um, oh, it's there. So it, it was a like a job lot on uh, on eBay for eight pound. Um, and I saw Age of Empires and Caitlin likes Command and Conquer, so I bought it mainly for them too. Um. Yeah, all this other stuff came with it. So, I mean, The Sims, I know Kenton likes The Sims. I might play it, I don't know. And then Desert Rats, that was kind of just there as well. But yeah, that's that. Quick little opening slash haul. Um, hasn't really been much to get, and we're still, I'm still broke after Blackpool. So, there's a... Yeah, there's going to be a little bit of a wait now. Obviously, Christmas is coming up. Um... And then I can go and spend more of my money. So that's going to be great. So there you guys go. Um, Wolfenstein is played through. Um, new order has been done. I'll be uploading that soon. Providing YouTube doesn't demonetize the shit out of me. If not, it's going up on the second channel. And the Old Blood, which is... I'm playing through it now. Again, I don't know what YouTube's going to be like. with with Because it shows bad signs and stuff like that. I don't know if it's going to be good or not. Um, but yeah. That is that. So, if you guys have enjoyed, please leave a like down below. Subscribe, all of that good stuff. Um, links to all my socials in the description box down below. Leave a comment if there's anything here you'd like to see. I'm looking at, you know, maybe doing this on the second channel. And, uh, yeah, it's been your boy. I'll see you all in the next one.